<laughs> look what I just bought, look what I just bought. Today, Anthony reviews the Gamdius headset, the Hephaestus, to be exact. And later, as always, we reveal the three winners in the $100,000 sponsorship powered by Freedom. I'm your host, Tiffany, and you're watching Impulse. Thanks so much, Tiffany. I appreciate it. Today, I wanted to talk to you about the Game DS, um, Gom DS, um, the Herfreti. Why do they always give me the ones I can't pronounce? Regardless of how you pronounce it, this headset is a strong contender for the best headset I've actually ever put on my head. It's very comfortable. In fact, it's really easy to forget that you even have on. In fact, right now, right now, I forgot I'm not even wearing it. Like I said, it is insanely easy to forget that you're even wearing this. Though it may look large and bulky, you can notice that there's almost no weight that you can even detect unless you move your head extremely quickly. Between the top headrest, which is padded, and the ear cups, which are also padded, this thing is uber comfortable. It doesn't really make your head or anything like that sweat, which is awesome because I've worn a lot of headsets that make your ears sweat and you have to take them off ever so often, which defeats the whole purpose. This thing is the pinnacle of comfort and it sounds even better than I could uh, describe. The construction is solid and in fact, it even packs flat so that if you're on your way to an LAN, grandma's house, or that buddy of yours who kind of smells like cheese but he has a nicer setup than you do, you can take this along and it's not going to take any damage on the way. The specs on this headset are absolutely phenomenal. It's capable of a lot of really cool stuff, but before we get to that, I think Tiffany... Rick. Rick? Tiffany. I don't know, one of those two has something they want to say. Have we fired her yet? Really, Anthony? I mean, really get rid of me? At least I know how to say Hephaestus versus Euphrates, because there's not even an R in there in Hephaestus, yet you found Euphrates? Hashtag Team Tiffany. And now in no particular order, let's announce the two runners up in the $100,000 sponsorship picked by Heartbeat Chrome. And of course you get to choose from all these lovely products brought to you by our partners with Freedom. If you wanna learn more about the $100,000 sponsorship, click in that nice little yellow star thingy in the sidebar to learn more information. Hey Rick, hey, can you say Hephaestus? Yeah, Hephaestus. Yeah, I thought so. <laughs> Our first runner-up is Random Help. He's proven that making friends with similar interests on social media sites will help increase viewership. He told a Whovian blogger on Tumblr to check out his Doctor Who review video and his viewership blew up unlike any of his other videos. He also reveals another great way to make friends on YouTube is to use a Google Chrome plugin called TubeBuddy, which easily allows you to communicate with your subscribers. Our next runner-up is... Trojan Gaming. He's proven that uploading a video about a newly released game will drive massive amounts of traffic to your channel. Around the time of FIFA 15 being highly relevant, he uploaded a squad builder video and saw an insane amount of views, the likes of which he's never seen before. He also really enjoys Zesty Mike's cost-effective ways to help grow our channels instead of spending hundreds of dollars on software or hardware. Congratulations, Freedom Partners! Woo! Now remember, you are still eligible to win first prize in a future episode of Impulse, so keep at it. And now back to Anthony. Hephaestus. This headset is capable of what's called blast source identification, which pretty much means that when you hear a loud booming noise, your headset vibrates just a little bit to notify you that something is going on around you. It's a great piece of tactile feedback and I really enjoyed it while testing these out. It's also capable of a virtual 7.1 surround sound, which pretty much means you hear in 3D, which is kind of awesome. You can also change the microphone in it so that you can increase the lows, increase the highs, and get just the right sound for your gaming experience. The microphone does cancel out a fair bit of noise from around you so that you're not always dealing with the fans in the room and that kind of thing. Because of the cooling system within the headset, you will not find yourself sweating under the headset. You will not find yourself having to take it off temporarily just to let your head cool down. It really is one of the best headsets I have ever worn. The only thing that would make this headset any better is if it were wireless.
What do you think? Have you had any experience with this headset? At this point, there's about a hundred of you who've had the opportunity to test this out. Let me know what you think. And before I go, I promise I'm not going to plug audible.com where you can totally get free ebooks and stuff. No, but you should definitely check out youtube.com slash Anthony Smith, where I'm going to be plugging audible.com where you can get free ebooks and stuff. Thanks, Anthony. And now for the moment you've all been waiting for. Dun -dun 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 -dun. Let's see who's gonna take home $250 in grand prizes. You get to choose from all these lovely prizes brought to you by Partners with Freedom. And because I'm the bigger person, I'm gonna let Rick do the announcement today. That's right, because I'm the bigger person. You go ahead, Rick. And today's winner is Mr. X-Rays. He's been listening to the Freedom Family's helpful channel growing tips in regards to uploading current event videos at the right time. By uploading videos about Lizard Squad taking down Xbox Live and the PlayStation Network, he saw a massive amount of traffic swarming his channel. This kind of buzz generated a viewership growth of 28% organically in the last seven days. Congratulations, Mr. X-Rays. You've officially replaced Gamma Rays as my favorite kind of ray. Congratulations, Freedom Partner, on a job well done. Remember to share your knowledge, discuss today's topics, and interact with fellow Freedom Partners in the comments below. And you too can be rewarded for bringing the community together, like a family. Hope you guys enjoyed today's episode of Impulse, and tomorrow Aaron is going to be interviewing Jim Bithy on How He Grew His Channel. Until next time, I'm your host Tiffany, and if anybody has a pair of white headphones, some of the Hephaestus to match my new Snow Commander, I really love you. Thank you. I see a train rolling all too fast, but I'm not even... Hush, Jack, you didn't win. Congratulated. <laughs> Hope you enjoyed today's up. Hope you guys enjoyed today's episode of Impulse. And tomorrow, Aaron is going to be going over Jim Bitcher. No. <laughs> Hope you guys enjoyed today's episode. And tomorrow, Aaron. I I had to stop anyway. I knew that was coming. <laughs> I did check out. Your secrets. If you really look at yourself, you would be speechless. What happened to being doctors and teachers? What happened to being your brother's keeper? Nowadays, kids more worried.